What? Can you mustard? Mustard. Girl, if you want to know more about this wig, stay tuned, okay? I am on a whole nother level. Girl, he only fought you over cause you let him. Girl, I guess he didn't know any better. Girl, that man didn't show me ever. Do all I can just. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tashina Beauty. And girl, if you want to know more about affordable hair, keep watching my videos. Hit the like button, hit subscribe. And if you're oldie but a goodie, thank you for rocking with me. You already know the deal. Do you see this? Girl, do you see this color? The color. Now, as you previously saw, I showed you what the inside of the cap looked like and the combs. I had two combs in the front, one in the back with the adjustable strap and it came with lace on it and I cut that off and I used my got to be glue and the freeze blast spray just to tack the sides down. Yep, I'm not moving this here because I like how it looks right now. I finally styled it to where I want it to stay. Um, this side keeps annoying the heck out of me but we working with her so by the front of the video you saw already you know this is the empress lace front edge wig um and it's the free part wig you can wear it in the center you can wear it to the left you can wear it to the right um the name is jocelyn and it the color is t2 mustard stock car looks like this now i Okay, so when I saw this color, and I have to be honest with you, I saw this color on another YouTuber, a big YouTuber, her name is Trendy K, and I saw that she had this color, and it was like a while back, she did a review on this hair, and I was like, that color is crazy good, I want to try it, but I was scared because other people tried it, and it didn't look so right on them, no tea, no shade, but I'm like, I don't think that color will come out looking good on me, but... I like color, I liked how it looked on her, but then again, Trendy K, if you don't know who she is, she makes anything look good. The girl can make anything look good. Um, so I was like, you know what, I'm gonna try that color. I just love that it looks kind of goldy, and I am into color lately, so I'm like, let me take a leap of faith here and jump out and got her. And I'm not disappointed at all um as you see i'm rocking her in the middle part i did not try her in a side part or the like on the side i i just kind of just plopped her on and i liked it in the middle and i kept it in the middle and if you know me you know that i do not like middle parts so that's kind of unusual for me but i i wear middle parts but i don't like them but i loved how it looked now i have all the hair to the front and it hits me at my breast um, I don't know, I think that's probably like 18 inches because I'm 5'3", I'm um, so it works. Now, Jocelyn is big head friendly because I literally, like when I put it on my head, I was like, there's no way I can try this wig on and not put like adhesive or something to help with the front because it is big on my head. Uh, and I and I didn't adjust it at all. I just kept it up where it was and it was big So I put gossipy boo as I said before and tack it down Now the con the cap construction on this wig is really really nice It is a bit spacey back there, which if you wear free part wigs um, You know that they're kind of spacey, but it's not bad where you're gonna see through it It isn't now I don't have my hair braided flat down actually this weekend is my wash weekend so I just have my old braids with a cap on wig cap on and I put her on I did not put powder in the parting space as you can tell but it looks the parting space is really really good with like after I put the wig on I was like oh that is so good and I don't need to put any parting like any if you want to go in and pluck, you can. I don't think you need to, but if you want to widen it out more, you can. But it looks great without me plucking it or doing anything to it. I just think she looks really, really good. And this color, I know some of you guys probably don't, won't like this color on me, but I like it. I think it's a nice, rich 
color and I know I've been lucking out with trying color lately I have actually liked pretty much almost every color that I've tried except for 1613 that didn't go so well for me it looks good but I don't think I styled it well so um, it looked great now as for shedding I haven't experienced any shedding yet but I know it will shed and it will tangle because this is synthetic hair and they will shed and they will tangle and eventually in the nape area it will tangle because when you sweat back there um, it will tangle on you I didn't show me cutting the lace off or putting the wig on because um, there's other people on YouTube who do that and yeah I actually have to put my wig on a wig um, on my wig stand and pin it down and cut it so that's it's kind of hard to show that on video maybe you, if you guys want to see that I'll actually show you how to do so um, the pricing for this wig I don't remember the pricing for it but I know she's very affordable so hence she'll be adding to the affordable series um, yeah I think the color is not like it may look shiny on camera but in person it's actually like you got bundle hair and someone dyed it this color it's perfect and then the dark root makes it look even more doable and natural in my opinion so honestly i'll be rocking this wig a lot like yeah you're gonna see me in the streets with this unit i just think it's 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 beyond nice um, I keep running my hand through it because I w I'm waiting for a shedding to show up, but it's she's not showing up yet. So I don't I don't know what's going on with that. I do think, however, though, my you have to be careful with your makeup with this unit. I am wearing a bright pink, but it's kind of more. It's a burgundy and pink lip. And if you want to see how I achieve this makeup look and this lip, please watch my makeup tutorial. I believe it's out before this video. Um, so check that out. But however, I wish I had went with like a nude lip so it wouldn't take away from this unit because the hair is bomb. And yeah, a nude lip would work so good. I don't think the pink looks so bad, but a nude lip would be so, 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 so much better with this unit. Um, yeah, I love this unit. I love this unit. Oh my goodness, I love this unit. And it's so like soft and I can run my hands through it and it's and it's not tangling on me. I just lost the airing. Yes, if you saw that, I just lost my airing. I'm not bending over to pick it up. I'm just not. Mm -mm. Nope. 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 Um, funny thing is, actually, I'm heading out on the road. And shout out to my shirt that matched. But when I started um, to show you the cap construction, I noticed that I had on a red shirt. And I'm like, that's not going to work for me, girl. I am trying it on with a mustard shirt. And I think it goes well. I'm running out to get some stuff. And I'll be back. And that's actually going to be another video. It's a surprise video. Um, so watch out for that. Please check out my makeup tutorial on this look. It's, this is my everyday look, so check out my makeup tutorial on that look. And yeah, until next time, guy. This is your girl, Tashina Beauty. Bye.